What's up, my YouTubers? Welcome to episode four of Clarence in His House, New York City style. I'm your host, Clarence Pryor, the host with the most. And this is a very special episode because this landmark means the most to the community and it's a touchstone ever since I, I was born in 1985. This is the most important touchstone of a bar ever. It's the legendary Stonewall Inn. Let me tell you some history about it. Before I was born, this there was the riot going on on June 26, 1969. The LGBTQ community had to fight for their rights and it was really hard that they had to struggle for who they are. But they are brave, the community is brave, resilient, and strong to be themselves. So here you see the soul all in right there. Uh, because I, I've been here like a couple of times and for what is important with these, with these pride flags, and there's something over here as well. So hold on, hold on. Oh man. This shows much history here. This shows much history. Uh, you see through every image, they're showing Stonewall history for many generations. This is why the community itself is a heart and touchstone of the Stonewall in itself. Now, hold on, I gotta show you something. See these? <laughs> oh man, this is truly amazing right here because this is where the community, this is where the community and allies come here to have a good time, enjoy this show, and be whoever they want to be. I mean, it doesn't matter who you are, as long as you live your life, live your authentic self. And this is really important because I know this marks 10 years of my journey coming out. And I'm glad I made it through the milestone to be myself. And for what is worth for the community being here, including allies supporting it, with everything going on this year, I'm, pr I'm proud to take action. All into Jackie Cox from RuPaul's Drag Race and Marty Gold coming from Drag Me Today on Hulu. Um, thank you guys for thinking of New York and because New York is the heart and touchstone of everything. So I just want to come on here to give a powerful advice to the LGBTQ community, including those who are struggling and coming out. Don't be afraid to be yourself. Be your authentic self. Journey to your heart. Just journey to your heart of being who you are. If, if some don't accept, if some accept you, I'm proud. But if some don't, forget them. Honestly, this is truly what's important. Also, there was this a documentary called Stonewall Forever on YouTube. It's still there. You can watch it on YouTube anytime. And it's really important. So either way, if you want to visit the legendary soul wall in, come by here. Wait, see, see that right there? Anyway, I'm gonna be heading out home soon. Um, don't worry, my month in New York is just getting started. So I wanna make sure to come on here to let the LGBTQ community know that you are not alone. Just journey to your heart to be who you are. I mean, I have to be in myself after 10 years. So for what it is worth, just j follow your own journey, find your own path, and do whatever it takes to make you be you. So make sure you follow the Stonewall Inn on Instagram at the Stonewall Inn. So f and don't forget the Stonewall Museum is coming next year right near Stonewall Inn. So live your authentic life. Just do whatever you can that makes you you. If some accepts you, I say congratulations, but if some don't, it's their loss to not understand for what the community has been going through all these years, for decades. And for what it's worth, I'm glad that I helped with Human Rights Campaign, Glad Trevor Project, anything. So until then, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on what you think of the store in and, in and what it means to you. So until then, peace out and much love and pride to you all.